Hey there doll friends, welcome back! In today's wig tutorial, we'll be making this lovely side pony hairstyle. Are you ready? Let's begin! Make a wig cap by covering your doll's head with cling wrap for protection and secure a cloth over with an elastic. Tuck the elastic under the doll's ears. Brush on three to four coats of white glue and here I'm using Elmer's glue wall. Once dry, fill in the areas we'll cut off later like the ears and the corners of the back part. And then, draw a guideline to mark the bangs area. Once that's done, Take it off the doll's head and trim off the excess. One hank of yarn should be enough for this project if you're careful with making webs. But to be safe, let's use two and I'll mix these two colors and add a few streaks of white as well to create a nice ocean palette. If you're new to my channel, please check out my separate video tutorial on how I make yarn webs. To glue the webs, I'll be using a stronger tool. Separate your webs into groups and keep a few straight ones for the bangs and curl the rest. Next, let's start filling up the bangs area. If you've seen a few of my videos, you already know that I cut hair as I glue each layer. I struggle less this way. To do this, separate the hair you intend for the bangs and cut. This for sure will happen, so whip out your toothbrush or brush dipped in water and use it to tame this fluffy mess. Then, cover the bangs with cling wrap to keep it protected from the next set of webs we'll be gluing. Now grab your curly webs and glue it around the edges of the bangs and the wig cap. Once dry, glue another set on top of it, but in opposite direction. Instead of using elastics, I decided to try using yarn to tie the hair together. Gather the inner set into the side and tie. good. Next, loosen the top of the webs of the outer set and gather it carefully to the side as well and tie with the rest of the ponytail. This part could be tricky, so take your time and do it slowly.
Then, cut a small piece of weft and wrap it around the yarn tie to keep it hidden. Lastly, shave the longer side of the bangs with an eyebrow razor and you're done! I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial. Now go ahead and try this look on your doll. Show me your work on Instagram and use the hashtag #MosiquitaLook so I can see and feature you on my next video. And by the way, I'd like to say a huge thank you to everyone for helping me reach more than 30,000 subscribers. I'm very grateful to each of you who loves and support my work, and I have so much more in store for you. So stay with me, and let's go on this creative journey together. Thanks again for watching, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss out on future stuff. See you on the next one, bye!